Hey, Jeff Adorno from Earthwalker. I want to talk about fat wood. You've maybe heard the term, but don't know what it is. I'm about 7,000 feet in a conifer forest, and that's a great place to find fat wood. Basically, um, it's, an, it's in a conifer forest, you get a place in, in a pine tree where all the sap has, has condensed. And often this will happen when the tree dies, it's dead and standing, and the tree sap will slowly you know, with gravity fall to certain places on the tree. Um, this was a really unusual event right here. We had some big storms this year and from one of these old ponderosa pine trees, a branch cleaved off, broke off and just javelined itself smack in the earth solid. It looks like a tree growing, but it's actually just speared in there. And so this event was unusual and allowed for the sap to kind of gravity, uh, making it condense probably in areas like this, where there's curves in the branches. And I cut this piece off from here because I could see clearly the way all the sap, come on over here, was condensed. You can see it right here. That's all fat wood right there. When you look at the cross section, the white stuff's not, but this dark amber, that's all fat wood. And you can see it right in there. That's all fat wood. So I'm gonna cut this off and split it open and show you what it looks like. You can just see all that pitch right when I'm cutting. Yeah, see all that amber, that's all great fat wood. So what that is is ideal fuel for the fire. All that pitch will just accelerate the burn. Now it's not always practical to carry around bunches of this stuff, but you can carry a little bit in your kit. And in situations like this where you want, you know, a, a fuel accelerant, why not? That's all, that's all good pitchy fuel there. Same with that. But there I can split those into nice little sh shavings, into nice little stakes, and uh, that's fat wood, guys. Right. That'll burn nice and hot. You can smell it, it's very resinous. So a practical way of packing this fat wood is to cut it down into small sections like this. And you can keep it like this and just, there's a lot of fuel, there's a lot of ignition right there. But you could choose to get it down even, even more so. <clears throat> Where's my, here, let's use this. That is dense with pitch. This isn't the best hammer, but here we go. Getting it down even smaller. And just a little bit of this stuff will be a great advantage for fire ignition, creating a sustainable fire. Just keep a little bundle of this stuff in there. And your kit and, and I, I could even get these down even thinner and you'd be that much more of an advantage but with a little bit of tinder and this you should have no problem starting a fire especially uh, an advantage in inclement weather where it's damp or relative humidity is high snowy rainy fatwood is an awesome advantage see the way that pine pitch just torches out it's got a an additive fuel in there. It burns really well. Oh. 